All right, guys, welcome back to another episode of the Undisputed Career Mode. If you've been keeping up with this series, in our last episode, you'll know that we had our very first professional loss. It's unfortunate. It happens. You know, we had quite a few injuries and other things that went on. Not making excuses, but, you know, it happens. So, um, gee, I am really, really undertrained. So I guess I'll focus on my fight sharpness. Okay. But I'm gonna be super overweight too, Jesus. Alright. Okay. Switch that to weight reduction real quick. And give me one more for fight readiness. Okay. Jesus. Alright. Let me see. I know, I know. All right. Um, who is gonna give me the most? I could fight Gregory Anderson. He'll give me a lot of money. Hmm. Maybe Jalen Thompson, because I I do want to climb the ranks. Hmm. Yeah. Plus, I've already fought Gregory like three times. You're ranked a little higher, and your overall rank, or not rank, uh, your overall stats are a little higher than what I would like to fight right now. So I guess I'll go with Jalen. Uh, what do you have? What was this? Oh. I'll answer that later. Uh, let me see. So health regeneration is increased for 20 seconds, or by 20% for 15 seconds upon leaving dazed. Yeah, okay. We'll negotiate. But I want a little bit more as far as money. Give me 51%. You'll think they'll give me that. Five-week training camp. You can give me six. Uh, actually, no. I'll I'll make do with five. Fine. Attempt. They accepted. Great. All right. I will try to manage this fight camp, and I'll see you guys at the fight. This rivalry has been brewing for a long time, and it spills over tonight at Brooklyn Hall. I'm Todd Grisham. And next to me for the broadcast, the one and only Johnny yeah, this Nelson. This is another fighter that has a winning nice record. I haven't fought too many of them, the but um, the I'm glad to be in an actual advantage. boxing arena again. It's always nice. Hands. Who's been your favorite middleweight champion? First up, we have oh, yeah. the Here machine we go. from the United States of America, coming off a very close win. Twelve and one. Only four knockouts, man, but I'm trying to change that. They'll be squaring up against Lightning Hands from the United States of America. Their last fight was a very close victory. They have waited for this fight for so long, Todd. This is ridiculous. And now for the official introductions. We turn it over to the world-renowned Jimmy Lennon Jr. This bout is scheduled for six rounds of boxing. Fighting out of the red corner from the United States of America. Wearing the blue trunks trimmed with yellow. The Machine. Fighting out of the blue corner from the United States of America. Wearing the black trunks trimmed with orange. Lightning Hands. What a pleasure to be in this unique environment. Every seat has been taken for tonight's match. Thank you, Todd. You know what? Outside, it's hot. Inside, it's roasted. So they stare into each other's eyes one final time, touch gloves, and get prepared for battle. All right. Here we go. And there's the bell to start the round. Loose footwork right off the bat. Oh, you can already see my stamina kind of taking a hit. 
Oh boy. Okay, working my body already. Ooh. That was nice. Nice defense on that. I've actually been working a lot on my punch power. Yeah. Oh, you can already tell the difference in my punch power, man. Oh yeah. Try to cut off the ring a little. Oh my god, yes. This was the wise investment. Oh yeah. Okay, a little too eager now. Calm it down. Yeah, because I decided to invest in power rather than my uh, endurance because I was getting sick and tired of being able to like rock someone several times but not actually find the shot to knock him down. And it could be that this guy doesn't have the greatest health. I'll be honest. I didn't really pay too close attention to his stats. But, oh my, I don't know how that freaking missed. I guess he cut me. That's fine. Oh my god, wow. He's doing work to the body now. These two fighters are, despite what the judges' scorecards read, there are no losers in this one. Oh my god, yeah. How many times did I rock him? Like three times in that first round? Good first round for me, man. Alright, man. Here we go. Here we go. Coming off that fantastic last round. Let's see if he can keep his momentum going. Oh, yeah. They're going to throw it in. Trying to really pick my shots here. What do you do? You step back. Steady yourself. Recompose yourself. Good. Back into it. But do not make those mistakes. Oh, you're lucky. That was a nice little counter shot. Right up the middle. Ooh. It's like a game of joust. They both got their swords. Nice. That was nice. And as you can see here, finally a knockdown early in this fight, man. I need to love it. So I have from a different angle. Hmm. And he crumbles. One more time, sorry. Boom. And he falls. He'll get up, though. It's very rare that I knock someone down once and they stay down. Okay. I just ate my own words. He actually stayed down. It happened. You saw it here live. A knockout win. Congratulations. Okay. Power punch perfect. That must hurt. Wow. Okay. That was surprising. Was not expecting that, man. <laughs> okay. Not bad. Now let's see what we get. Okay, 5,000. Nice. Ooh, fame. I love it. Up three, up four, five, three. Nice. He gave me an A. Thanks, coach. Nice. Cool, cool, man. All right. Um, what's my team looking like? They each have one left on their contract. Um, shoot. Probably focus on weight loss first. Okay. One. Two. And then the rest could be fight readiness or fight sharpness. I mean, one. 
and actually no one more for uh weight management yeah okay uh let's see got yet got my day all right tyson miller trevon will give me a lot of money you give me a decent amount of money and the most fame Reginald. Have I fought Reginald before? I feel like I have. Yeah, I did fight him before. Okay. I fought Trevon, right? Yeah, I did. Knocked him out. Oh, he was the one that was, that gave me a super tough fight. Um, you're 7,000. You're the only one with the winning, winning record. Um, it's tough. Okay. I do kind of need money because I'm going to have to like renew my coach's contracts too, and that's going to add up. So I guess I'll go with you. What did I beat you with? Decision. Okay. I'm going to try to knock you out this time, but I want one more week of training. Yeah. Okay. Good. And attempt. Good. Okay. As usual, I will see you guys at the fight. Ah, man, I'm back in a boxing gym again. Ah. Whatever. Okay, skip this. Let's get right to the action, shall we? Loose footwork. <laughs> ah, moose. Good. Oh, okay. Been really working on my left hand power. I got decent hand speed now. It's not the greatest. It's not like Ryan Garcia fast, but it's formidable. At least for this point that I'm at. Ooh, okay. Oh, boy. Oh, yeah, that was a good left hook. Right hook, too. Okay, combos are landing now. Ooh. Body. Good. Look at me trying to use the head movement now. Oh, the combinations are flying. Okay. I'm a little too cocky with my head movement. I'm not that good with head movement. Body. Oh, you're lucky. Straight. That yeah, kind of got through. Wait a bit. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Good. That was just my buddy he used to work with. But. Yeah. Uh, Call him Moose. He's asking if I thought this game was worth sixty dollars right now, and honestly, I don't think it's really worth sixty. 
I think this game has potential. Don't get me wrong. There are definitely parts that I've enjoyed, but other parts seem kind of lackluster. I mean, if you want this game, I would wait, you know. I mean, Christmas is around the corner. You don't have too much longer before Christmas. Maybe you'll be able to get a good deal. Because, you know, look, I've been waiting for a boxing game, a new boxing game for a while. And, I mean, look, I've said it before, I'll say it again. This didn't come from a AAA, you know, um, company. But, you know, they did, they did do what they could. Probably with the limited resources that they had compared to other big companies. I think the names that they were able to get was impressive. Like, who would have thought they would be able to sign Canelo, right? But, you know, you look at the roster of this game compared to, like, Fight Night Champion. You know, the roster is going to seem lackluster. Character customization could be improved. You know, like I said earlier with the uh, training games. Well, I don't even know if you can call them training games. Um, because you don't really interact with them. It's really just like, oh, what do you want to improve? And you just click one and it automatically increases that stat for you. It's like a simulation, rather. Um, I mean, look. They, I knew going in that, like, this game wasn't going to be perfect. It is definitely lackluster in areas, but... I mean, if you were to get this for, like, 30 or 40 bucks, I think it'd be worth it. Yes, it's not worth 60 right now, you know, in my honest opinion. And it kind of sucks for PC players too, right? Because you guys got early access, and I think essentially you guys had to pay like twice, right? I mean, it is what it is. See if I can get him out. I didn't even realize there was already a third round. Oh boy, okay. Okay, good. Good. Oh, we're just slugging now. That was a good body shot. Oh boy, watch my stamina. Watch it. Oh, you're lucky. Nothing but power shots. Ooh, okay. I see his head health flashing, man. I see that head health flashing, but I haven't found the shot to drop him. Good. Ooh, okay. Oh, yeah, there we go. Take him apart. Yes. 
Looked for our opening, we found it. <laughs> Very nice. One, two, three, four, Stay down, buddy. Five. Stay down. He wants more. I'll give it to him. I just realized how that sounded. For anyone that has a dirty mind. I didn't mean it that way. I didn't realize how bad his block was. Oh, okay. I thought I could get through his block. Uh, about 10 seconds left. Can I finish him? Oh, you're lucky. Combos. Ah, couldn't get him down again. That's all right. A win is a win, I guess. Okay. Alrighty. Five rewards, please. Okay, 6,000 fame. Cool. One up one. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, it is what it is, I guess. Cool. All right, what is this? Oh yeah, I gotta renew all their contracts. Right. Okay. Um, I want to renew you. Yes. Okay. I will renew you. Taking all my money, man. All right, and I will renew you. Okay. Good, good, good. So I'm actually pretty good as far as weight. They'll do one, and then the rest can be uh, fight ready sharpness. Yep, good. Simulate. Simulate. And simulate. Good. Okay. And who do we got? Not I come on, let me worry about that. Alrighty, Eric Moore. Ooh, damn, Eric. You didn't give me thirteen thousand. Hmm. You give me the most, uh, as far as fame. You give me this. No, you don't give me the most money. But I'll probably climb the rankings faster. You have a winning record. Which would look better for me. Spaceman. Alright. Let's see. What's your power looking like? 70? Okay. Hmm. And. Alright. Increase damage of punches received to the body by. 25%. You have a paper chest, huh? It increases stamina loss from receiving body shots by 20%. Increases damage of all directional punches by 15, and when standing still, punches deal 5% less damage. Huh. You know what? Um, I'm going to choose you, Marco. I get 53%, huh? Actually, can I change the... 
higher rank, huh? Let me see. Brooklyn Hall. Copy Box Academy. Brooklyn Hall. That sounds like an actual arena, right? I think. Okay. Yeah, I'm fine with that. Cool. Alrighty. So we got that negotiated. As usual, do all this training. See you guys at the fight. I'm Todd Grisham, and every fighter wants to say at least once, they fought at Brooklyn Hall. And here we are. And here with me, my broadcast colleague, it's Johnny Nelson. I feel like a fraud. How have I got these ringside seats? It's time for our tale of the tape. First up, we have the machine, and they will enjoy a power advantage. Up against them, it's Spaceman. Historically, this is one of the most prized divisions in all of boxing, the middleweight division. As you First up, we have the machine from the United States of America. I do like the um, a very close win. I do like the lighting, man. I might have to think about changing the uh, color of my trunks and stuff. I just don't know what, though. And they'll be facing Spaceman from Mexico. The last time they were in action, they scored that dramatic TKO victory. Let's see how they do in this one. You can hardly hear yourself speak. The fans are going mad for this. This bout is scheduled for six rounds of boxing in the red corner from the United States of America, wearing the blue trunks trimmed with yellow. The machine hiding out of the blue corner from Mexico, wearing the black trunks with red trim. Spaceman. Not too many seats to be had in this arena as the hype continues to build for this showdown. You couldn't buy a seat in this place. You'd be very lucky if you're ringside, but you know what? Watch it from home. You've got everything on a plate. You can tell both of these fighters are exuding confidence as they touch gloves. And here we go. We're Ready. Let's go. Loose footwork right off the bat. Stamina's a little low because, you know, it did kind of uh, overtrain a little bit. Wasn't able to fully recover, but it is what it is. At least I'm in weight. Have my fight sharpness up pretty good. I'm going to try to work his body. My punch speed is slowly getting better. Okay, hold on. Let's try to... Track him down. Body. Uppercut. Nice uppercut. The most difficult punch to What's he gonna give me an opening with? Oh yeah, that was nice. Good job defending the jab. Okay. Right. Jab. Jab straight. These fighters have had their moments. This fighter has a very good win-loss record and will be tough to beat. Okay, there we go. And he just misses with that jab. Jab. Jab straight seem to be working pretty well. Ah. Uh. Which fighter will say no moss? Ah, oh, come on. And just as quickly as the action slows down, it heats back up. Oh yeah, I just forgot. This is a six-round fight, too. So I gotta be careful with my stamina. Just missed with that jab. Always pretty offensive-minded. Got yeah, cool it on the you know combos. The are be all over nice. The in this oh, I thought I was gonna knock him down for a sec. My punch power, at least for my left hand, is getting pretty close to 80. Talk about a one-sided three minutes. We just saw it. You can't leave it up to the judges. It's up to you as a fighter. And the cornerman's got to put a fuck. Okay. Good first round, at least. And there's the bell to start the round. Rio. Last round, complete domination. Let's see what we have in store for us here. Todd, my motto is, 
If it's not okay. broken, why change it? An excellent last round. Everything works. Wait for the reaction. Oh boy. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down. Okay. Oh, try to try to roll with it. You know, at some point, I would like to fight that Ukraine guy again. The one that beat me. In our, what, previous episode? If I ever get a chance to fight him again, I'm taking it. It'd be interesting to see how I could, you know, how much better my performance could be when I'm not injured, you know? Oh damn. Halfway through the round, and I don't know who's got the advantage. Great stuff. You can run a script like oh, this. Boy. This is like Rocky versus Apollo. Hey, they made a Rocky reference. She's like a match made in heaven. Ah. That jab had to hurt. So I haven't found the shot to rock him. Nope, you know what? I think I'm probably going to end up getting more knockouts. If I get fights that, you know, are like six to eight rounds or really anything more than four, I probably have a better chance of actually knocking these guys out. Despite what the judges' scorecards read, there are no losers in this one. Because there have been so many times, or so many fights, where I've been able to rock dudes multiple you know times in a four round period but wow, it was like two haven't can't always find the shot to put him down which can kind of get annoying after a while let's hope this round is more competitive that was a tough last round now you've got to make sure he doesn't put on him that's what he's gonna try and do oh that was a nice one lean on him don't get drawn into a fight not yet until your senses have come back okay this is a good range It was a little too close. This range right about here is good. I don't know how that buy shot missed, but all right. You don't want to trade shots. Still a good range for you. Good. By the way, the connect percentages have to be off the charts. Accuracy is not too bad, I guess. Oh boy. I can't believe we're only halfway through the round. Good looking jab. Ah, oh, how's that left hook miss? Come on. It shows the skill, the discipline, the respect both fighters have for each other because no one dare do anything out of turn. Okay. All my combinations are staying bland. Uppercut, the most difficult punch to land clean, and he just did it there. Having a lot more in this fight than I usually am in all the others. Oh, nice. Ooh, that one hurt me. Cut off the ring. Okay, cool it, cool it. Got him hurt. We got the round in the bag. Nice. Good. This would be. So close, buddy. Dominant round there. Let's see how they respond here in the next round. It's a midpoint. Keep your guard up. Look for openings. Still up. What do you mean they won the last round? What? You're crazy, coach. No way I lost that last round. We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. That last round was huge for him, Johnny. How does he keep the momentum going? Good. So it's two rounds to one. Okay. Why change it? An excellent last round. Everything works. I keep at this distance. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down. Oh yeah, that was good. Throwing the hook, but it doesn't score. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, you're lucky. The bravery being shown here is just incredible. Good. Kind of taking them apart now. Oh, my. oh yeah. That's a game changer. Body. Oh. It's only a matter of time, buddy. We're at the halfway point of this round, and both of these fighters have had their moments. Still could go either way. Uh, get over here. Right back into the line of fire he goes. Now they've got to wake up. They've got to get on the back foot. Clear the head a little bit, then jump back yeah, go to the body. It's all about the hustle. Get back on it. What recovery skills they are. What a shot it was. Completely gone. I thought there's Ooh. no way he's going to finish this round. But look at that. Look at the movement. Look at the speed. Back I'll tell you what, man. This guy's got good recovery. My God, he's just eating all the shots. This is probably the, the best my accuracy has been. It bombs away. A very competitive round with ten seconds left. Oh. Yeah, I mean, I'm piecing him up, man. That was almost a 10-8 round. Complete dominance. You can't leave it up to the judges. It's... I'm really piecing him up. It's probably the best I've done offensive. At least as far as accuracy, you know. See if he can do anything to adjust. Oh, man. Power punching. Okay. Okay. It's a good range right here. Right about here. We're at the end of my jab. And that jab just missed with the left hand. Good. Oh, I didn't realize my stamina was bad. Oh my god. Guy's got a chin on him though. One punch is good, two punches better. This guy's got a hell of a chin and good recovery. Oh, kind of beat me to the punch there. What? I didn't miss. Good. Halfway through the round, I'm not sure who's winning it. Good. Oh my God, he's still on his feet. There we go. I don't. Man, he's been Thank God. No about it as we see I had to really and work to knock this dude down, man. Holy crap. From the gods took him out. I thought I would be able to knock him down a lot sooner, to be honest. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. In, you're out. Take it. I will gladly take it. You heard that right, ladies and gentlemen. A knockout victory. I like it, man. I like it. What a build up. What a journey towards this fight. What a fight itself. The crowd enjoyed it. The fighters enjoyed it. I certainly enjoyed it. And what a way to the win. The one time I knocked him down, that was enough for the knockout. I like it. Oop. Yeah, 45%. Not bad. Okay. Cool. See what my coach says. <clears throat> Five reports, please. Okay, 9,534 fame. Holy crap. What is that trait? I need to know what that trait is. Up two, up three, three, three. Nice. Slowly getting there, man. He gave me an A. I love it. Thank you, coach. Man, a counter. Yeah, I am not the best um, counter puncher. Definitely not. But let's see. New coach straight unlocked, huh? All right. What do you have for me? Ooh, inside fighter. All right, hold on. When entering inside fighting, increase the damage 
of thrown punches by 10% when I was inside fighting, but also increases the chance of being flashed dazed by 10. And then this is Liver Destroyer. Increases the damage of left hook stone to the body by 35%. Yes, please. Um... Actually, yes. Can you... Wait. Okay, never mind. There we have it. Good. And I can do this, too. All damage that was increased by 25%, but it also increases damage taken by 25%. I usually fight in the uh, loosey-goosey stance anyway, so why not? Okay. Speaking of which, um, hold on, take me back here real quick. My team. Okay, you have one fight left. You have two. Okay. Good, 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 good. So I need to overtrain. Okay. I'm going to leave this episode here. Hope you guys have enjoyed watching. Consider leaving a like comment, subscribe to the channel, helps me out, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.